Labor pains are not stopping the big three automakers from showing off the best of what's next at the International Auto Show in Detroit. Mike Cottle is standing by with his report. Mike. Welcome to the 2023 Detroit Auto Show. You know what, guys? It's great to be back here at the Auto Show. You know, if you think about auto shows as a whole, they all got shut down during COVID. And to be honest, the Detroit Auto Show was the one that probably struggled the most, but it's great to be here. We're calling this now America's Car Show because the big three have definitely showed up starting with this one right here this is the all-new 2024 ford f-150 it gets an all-new redesign for the new model year this one happens to be the tremor package which means it's all about off-roading but if you make your way to the rear of this we all think about the tailgate wars happening in the auto industry well ford has brought what they believe is a new answer to the tailgate check this out it not only folds down the regular way but you also have a button here where you can open this up and actually step inside your truck making it super easy to gain access to your truck bed. Now, speaking of the interior, you're gonna get a 12 inch touchscreen display on the inside. And for the first time, they're integrating in their autonomous driving feature called Blue Cruise. Now, this being the Tremor, you're getting this off-road packaging, this styling, this thing is really meant to pound the dirt off-road, not to mention inside, your tailgate right here, you got a lot of functionality. Now GMC launching the all new Acadia here at the auto show. It actually gets longer by almost 10 inches in length, not to mention it gets a bit wider. What I love the most is a new front end design with this GMC right here. But again, this is a GMC. This is the Denali edition of the Acadia and they want you to know it is all about luxury and performance with this Acadia. Now, you can't have an auto show without talking about high performance. You get that with the Cadillac CT5. By the way, Cadillac posting their best month, 70% in revenue share over this past month. One of their best years to date with the CT5, two turbocharged engines under the hood and a 33 inch display on the interior. Jeep taking the covers off the new Gladiator that has been updated. Oh, check this out guys, right here, a new front grille on the Gladiator. Also, if you look at it from a side design standpoint, it gets a boxier look and the front window will fold down as well. Functionality, off-road adventure with the Jeep Gladiator. Now, Lincoln showing off the Nautilus here at the auto show as well. Look at the front end design. This is so smooth. The silhouette is beautiful. And as you make your way to the inside of this Nautilus, check out this infotainment screen that spans from one side to the other. This thing is stunning. And guys, I'm gonna close it out with this right here. You wanna talk about modern technology and mobility? Check out the Air one drone. What about flying inside a drone? Eight rotors on the outside, you got 40 miles of distance, and you are going to have to get an FAA license with that drone. Guys, so much happening here at the Detroit Auto Show. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.